Lake Worth police are investigating a shooting involving one of their own officers. Our Nicole Jacobs just got out of a press conference. So, Nicole, what were police saying? Madison, Fort Worth Police and Grand Prairie Police are assisting in this investigation, but we know now that the police shooting involved Lake Worth police officers. And this morning, the Lake Worth police chief tells me his officer had no choice but to shoot. A male uh, exited the vehicle with a firearm in his hand um, and subsequently pointed it at one of the officers. Uh, the officer uh, said out loud, gun, 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 he's got a gun. Um, and then shortly thereafter, uh, our officer uh, engaged the male and shot him. The shooting happened shortly after 2 o'clock this morning when a Lake Worth police officer was actually conducting traffic patrol. That officer noticed a vehicle traveling 88 miles per hour in a 65 mile per hour zone. And when he got behind the car in an attempt to stop him, the driver turned off all of his lights and continued through Lake Worth, White Settlement, and finally ending in the Cuomo neighborhood of Fort Worth near Horn Street. We're told three individuals got out of the car and all ran in different directions, but it was the backseat passenger who got out of the vehicle and allegedly pointed a gun at the officers. And you can clearly see the gun. I've reviewed uh, the complete video myself, um, and it, it's very clear to see. Um, there's multiple videos of this incident um, from all different angles, so we're very confident that once it's all reviewed and, and presented in court, that it'll show a complete picture of what happened. And the man who was shot was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. His identity is not being released right now, pending notification of next of kin. Police are also not releasing the officers' names who were involved. We do know all of them are on paid administrative leave, pending uh, the outcome of an internal and a criminal investigation. But certainly, this is an ongoing investigation by multiple agencies. That's the very latest from Lake Worth this morning. Nicole Jacobs, CBSN DFW. Nicole, thanks so much.